hi guys welcome back to my channel i hope you are all doing well so today in this video i am going to prepare a very simple peanut soup very simple method guys so if you are looking for something that is so fast and simple then this is for you stay tuned okay so i'm using hard bone chicken Yes, a ifiakoko. Mm, unfortunately, a ye ifiakoko sa we a poetry akoko enemy you see. <laughs> okay, and I have uh, me ginger, and me wo me garlic, and a me meko, and a onion, and a also a uh, nketin kitty, and a seed, a uh, tomato paste, a yeah, yeah, if anything, tomatoes no, and of course, and cut your bottle no, and grounded or peanut butter. Yes, and me better try me jane kama kama kama. And the go a fancy me chicken. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. So I've already added a little bit salt and on the chopped onions on the chicken. All right, so here I'm going to stir so that all the spices, the salt, I added a little bit salt. So I have to stir and cover it and let it cook for a while before I can add the blended spices, guys. Okay, so it's about 10 minutes and I'm going to add the blended spices like I said, which is the ginger, garlic, and the seed and the pepper. I'm going to add it like you see on the screen. Right. Now I feel menu no come come. Then you have to cover it again for let it cook. You understand? Send a beya and quana a beya de de de. If you are making peanut soup or chicken soup, you need to take your time so that you enjoy it. Alright. Hey guys so after 10 minutes i just come back and check it again and it's not done enough so i'll go ahead and add my tomato paste and after adding the tomato paste i have to also cover it for another 10 minutes before i can you know go ahead and add my peanut butter but i have to make sure the chicken is well nicely cooked with the tomato and the oil also has settled on top Okay, so here i will leave it and go and do other things and come back later on and prepare my peanut butter okay okay guys so now it's time for me to mix the peanut butter you can also go ahead and put it in but no that's not how i want it so i prefer mixing it with water and add it into my steaming yeah so after adding it i have i also have to make sure that it to you know be on fire more than at least 10 to 15 minutes before i can add more water to make my soup yeah because this is the simple way you can actually do your peanuts separately before you add it into the soup all right just in case you are new to my channel and you like my videos kindly support my channel please subscribe to my channel share my videos and also click the notification button so that you get all my videos anytime that i upload them okay and to all my subscribers and my returnees thank you all so much may god which bless you guys keep supporting me okay and if you like this video you like this channel anything that you like give me your comments okay i also want to know your opinion about any video that i share with you guys thank you all right now i think i've stirred enough so i'm going to lower the heat so that it will take its time to cook and i have to see that the oil is settled on top before i can add hot water yes you can add cold water but hot water will make the game changing okay right so guys i will cover it and come back later and check it out okay guys so as you can see after 10 minutes the oil is settling on top this is the time for me to add my hot water you know okay so after adding the hot water then i have to add also fresh ginger onion and also fresh tomatoes okay so guys one of my subscribers asked me to make peanut butter stew and i promise that i'm going to make it 
yeah but there is not peanut butter stew please just in case you are watching it know that i still have it in mind i'm going to prepare it for you okay one of these days i will try my best and make it for you it's a promise it's a promise <laughs> okay guys now i've added the hot water i will give it a good stir okay so after that then i will cover it and let it cook and come back and add the fresh onion ginger and also the tomatoes like i said okay so guys now i'm going to blend my other remaining ingredients okay and after blending it i'll put it inside and cover it and let it cook for another 15 to 20 minutes then it should be done in cutting time let us say a bing at that sign the baby is here yeah. so get your fufu ready get your bengku or get your plain rice ready okay guys <laughs> <laughs> all right guys as you all can see my soup is perfectly done it's ready <laughs> okay so i'm going to pair this soup with fufu mm, fufu is my favorite though but you can actually pair with your favorite swallow or you know rice anything you know it's so delicious guys if you like this video kindly share and give me your thumbs up and comments under the video okay guys thank you so much and also i will meet you with another beautiful video until then stay blessed bye bye